Okay, so I'm on my old trusty old XP PC now. Um, this is the first time I've accessed this Drac card, so I'm going to log in. I'm going to try using Chrome. Um, now, I have had, I do vaguely remember having problems with various browsers in the past, um, Firefox and IE and all sorts of weird things going on with Java. So it'd be interesting to see how we get on with Chrome. So um, let's just put the IP address in. So that was dot thirty, and see what happens. Okay, so it's going to it's bouncing me off onto HTTPS. Obviously, it's using a self-signed cert. So proceed anyway. Uh, this looks good. There we go. So we've got the Drac login page. So let's log in. Remember, I set the pass, the username to root, and the password to Calvin. All right, looks like we're in. So looking good so far. Okay, so <clears throat> what we're going to need to do is configure the RAID controller. So let's see if we can get a remote console up. Okay, connect. This is where it all, always used to go wrong from what I can remember. So already we've got a blocked pop-up. Let's say always allow pop-ups. Right, so ah, this is where I might have to disconnect and try it again. Let's see if that, right, there we go. Oh, this is what I was talking about. Track 5 error. Install the virtual KVM plugin. Uh, browser plugins. Right, so maybe maybe this isn't going to work with Chrome. Ah, oh, right, okay. Forget that then. Let's try Firefox. Let's so see how slow my old PC is. Okay, so it's Firefox. One, let's put the IP address in. 192.168.0.30 I understand the risks, add exception, oh Jesus, I hate all this rubbish. Get certificate, confirm, right. Root, Calvin, nope, let's go to console, connect. I've just got to wait. Is it blocked to pop up? Oh, yeah. Here's the pop up. Don't even know what version of Firefox I've got on here. I keep bringing out so many new versions. doesn't look too good does it so you know what, let's just try that again no yeah, this brings back memories okay let's give up on that right Internet Explorer let's try that one 192.168.0.30. I'm sure we can probably get this stuff to work. It's just having the, the right plugins and Java versions and things loaded. Let's try uh, good old Internet Explorer. Well, when I say good, I hardly ever use it anymore. Root. Calvin. <clears throat> oh, I just feels so much slower. Console. Seems to use an ActiveX plugin, or it used to. Oh, here we go. Uh, pop ups.
Hmm. Oh, I think it just came up at the last minute there, just as I was disconnecting. <laughs> All right, let's connect again. Obviously, you've got to be a bit patient. Oh, here we go. Right, so now let's try to add. Okay, so this is an ActiveX control. Install this add-on. Install. This is what the other browsers should have done. They should have just done it. Is this in the name of security? Channel access denied. What the hell does that mean? Should we try again? Connect. Ah, there we go. Right. So it looks like it it works with Internet Explorer, which is what I vaguely remember happening last time. <laughs> I can't actually make the window the right size to get rid of the scroll bars. It's a bit annoying, isn't it? View full screen. Hmm, maybe not. Oh, there we go. Actually, I think there's a zoom option, isn't there? Is there a zoom? Hmm. Automatic video adjust. Definitely remember there being a full screen option. Anyway, so that's my console. So that's running. Uh, no boot device. So what I'm going to have to do is um, send the control or delete. <coughs> and then get into the RAID controller. So I'll start another video for that.